Om Shanti and today is the 54th day of your beautiful meditation blessing and how to meditate on that blessing and how important is this time. Let us know in this Vardhan that Baba explains the importance of this time, this special time when we souls get to meet the Supreme Soul, the Supreme God Father in reality. So at the end of Kali Yuga is the time when there is a transition between Kali Yuga to Satya Yuga. And that's the time God has to transition, has to come down on earth to show us the right path to be ready, to be purified, to go into the next age or the golden age or heaven on earth. And for doing so, Paramatma or Godfather says, your time is very crucial to fill all the powers, all the energy, all the good thoughts and everything else. So let's explore what exactly does he want us to do here. So in this blessing, Baba says, May you be constantly uh, be an embodiment of total success. Total success by using the elevated treasure of time in a worthwhile way. So let's go into the details. The children who use the treasure of time for the benefit of themselves. This important time to meditate on God. Not to go too much into worldly aspects, but to get in connection with God and take care of your basic needs. So the children who use the treasure of time for the benefit of themselves and everyone else automatically accumulate all other treasures. If I'm wasting my time talking about nonsense things which have no sense, if I'm wasting my time thinking about waste thoughts about others, automatically my vibrations are going to have an effect on the family members too. So I'm wasting their time, I'm wasting my own time. So. Baba says, for the benefit of themselves and everyone else, automatically accumulate all other treasures. Those who know the importance of time and use it in a worthwhile way, automatically accumulate the treasures of thoughts. Now, what are the treasures of thoughts? Either I'm thinking pure thoughts, impure thoughts. Either I'm thinking wasteful thoughts. Either I'm into why, when, what, where, who, why. So if I'm questioning all these things, I'm going into all depths of negative impure thoughts. So either I'm thinking pure or I'm thinking impure. So what is the real treasure here? You can understand that, right? Similarly, Baba says, treasures of thoughts, treasures of happiness in helping others to overcome their weaknesses is accumulating the right happiness. Treasures of power is the power to tolerate. Am I practicing that enough? Because at the end of the day, I need that power to tolerate. Do I have the power to decide? Do I have the power to discern? Do I have the power to accommodate situations and people? Because that's what I'll need at the end of the day. Yes. So do I have the practice or not? So the powers of knowledge and breath. Simply let go of carelessness and use the treasure of time in a worthwhile way and you will constantly be an embodiment of total success. The time is very crucial. And Baba wants us to use it in a worthwhile way in this time when we are in connection with God. So I leave you with this beautiful, beautiful blessing. Think about it again and meditate on it. With this, Om Shanti.